Hello and welcome back to my channel. This is Didsbury Art Studio and I'm Sally. And in today's video, I'm going to be making the front of a kind of halter neck dress using ribbons. Might sound a bit unusual. However, I do have a reference for it. I found a picture in a magazine a couple of months ago, saved it on my phone, and I'd like to give it a little bit of a whirl of how to go about making it. So let's get into so it. What I'm doing here is I've got some long lengths of ribbons and I've seen this piece in the magazine which is kind of like macrame on a mannequin. So I want to see whether I can do that. I'm using these ribbons because I've got quite a lot of the ribbons. So I'm going to do four colours. Of course, the dusky pink is making a comeback. So. So what we've got here is a cream grey and I've got the dusky pink which is a kind of pale grey and I just measured the first ribbons up against the mannequin just to see sort of how much I would need from the top to the floor and then what I'm going to do here is just fold over the top like so and then just pull the ribbon through. What I've decided to do then is two of each colour and notice that I've had to switch up the dark grey ribbon there with the gold one as I've just run out in the lark's head knot and you can see that the ribbon goes all the way down to the floor and what I'd like to begin by doing is using the square knot at the top and then we're going to have just a layer of the ribbon and then we'll go into the would you look at this guys I've made up this contraption <laughs> of holding my palm across my two tripods here, which you can see. <laughs> so, uh, right then. So we're gonna do a square knot. So I've got my four lengths and I'm gonna take the left-hand side over the top of the middle two, like so. And then I'm gonna take this one behind and pull that up. And then to carry on and complete the square knot, I'm going to take the right hand ribbon over the top of the middle two, take the left hand ribbon, take it back behind these two and up over this side. And then pull that up like so. Okay, for the next bit, we're going to do a double half hitch knot. First two strands here, and I'm going to put this one behind there and take it over this ribbon. I'm holding it just here, and then you just pull the ribbon 
through the middle of that. And you do that twice. So we're going over and pull that through like so. And then I'm going to grab the next strand of ribbon, make your shape and take it through the middle. I'm going to do that twice. So over the top and take it through the middle. And we carry on. Obviously it gives a very different effect to the cord using the ribbon, but this is what I want to use. So go to the next ribbon. trying to get it to curve for the neckline so I'm going to sort of hitch it up a little bit to go higher at this right hand side. Okay gang this is where we're up to the square knots. The ribbons go down to the floor still just about and next up I'm going to be leaving the ribbons flat and then I also want to do another double half hitch knot around this area here. Is do this, throw that on. Right, so we're on to the double half hitch knot again, and I want it to go around this area. So I'm going to take this one behind. I'm going to try and follow that pencil line. I think I might just put some beads up the top here just to begin with. Oh, that's quite nice. So I'm just, I'm just going to thread them through. Okay, so we got some beads on there and then I'm just gonna crack on now with the double half hitch knot over here. I'm gonna take this one behind, gonna hold it at the pencil line, make our little shape here, pull that through. That's where I want it to go. My shape, take that through. I'm going to the next one, that one goes behind, pull it up, make that shape, pull that through. Take that 
Get that through, through there, and pull. And the next one, behind, in front. Here we're on the last one. Okay, so that's how it's looking so far. I just got the double half hitch knot just to go along the... Yeah, I'm happy with it so far. I've just added a couple more beads on this next row here. So there's the top in the middle and I've got another line I've just drawn out for a double half hitch knot and I've got one more to do after that. So what I'm now going to do just to finish this off is I'm going to do the double half hitch knots underneath this little panel here and then we'll take a look at what it looks like. I've added the double half hitch knots at the bottom there and overall I'm very happy with the piece. It's just a little bit of fun. I wanted to do some macrame, the ribbons and yeah I've just added um, some of the core, the halter neck of that dress but yeah I hope you like it. And I'll So I hope you enjoyed this video today and if you did don't forget to give me a like and subscribe and please hit the notification button so that you can see when I upload next and I'll see you in a brand new video next time. Bye!